What's up, y'all? This is your hair go mouth. I am back, and I'm going to show you guys how my hair look like. I what my hair look like. I done rinsed it out, rinsed the deep conditioner out, and y'all see I took it out my eyebrows too. If y'all was watching the last video, oh my God, towel getting all stuck up in here. Y'all have to excuse me, but um, we um somebody washing clothes, so y'all gonna hear the washing machine going. Um, this is what my hair looks like when the deep conditioner is out. Y'all see how that just fell, girl. This is my second time using this conditioner, or is it my third? Whatever time it is, I think it's my third. Whatever time it is, I, oh my God, my hair is just lovely. Just lovely, y'all. Love to the leave. I don't even want to put no leave-in on it, but I will put a little leave-in on it, just a little bit. Actually, this ain't the room, this ain't the leave-in I want. Hold on, let me get my smell good. Sorry, y'all. I had to get my smell good. My Elastic QP Olive Oil Mango Butter Leave-In Conditioner is what I want to use. And what I use for my leave-in smells. So good. Like, so good. Yes. So, I put a little bit of this on. If y'all don't have this in y'all life, honey, trust and believe when, when I tell you this make your hair smell good. And it's so refreshing after, um, you know, being in the uh putting that grease on my hair for so long this is so such like a breath of fresh air you get to smell your hair smelling all good and stuff and um whew, comb that through a little bit just that just that much because my hair was kind of you know together so i put that little leave in on there mm -hmm. smells amazing put a little bit on my make sure i get that uh them edges where I put that color at y'all um and tie this back up and I do each section the same way and before this is what I do before I blow dry it oh and I also but I just let it dry I let it air dry for a little while so I walk around with my hair just puffed up like this when I get through with these puffs When I get through with these puffs. Child, I'm trying to talk and think at the same time because somebody just twisted my doughnut. Um, so when I get through, oh, my hair feels so good. It smells so good. It's just good, y'all. Everything just good. Now, I usually don't comb my hair when it's wet, but I comb it through one time. But remind y'all, I got this big old big tooth comb right here. So it ain't doing too much of damage. I just put it through one pass and clip it back up, y'all. So do the same thing. On, did I do this side yet, y'all? I don't know. Do the same thing on this side with the leave-in. Just a little bit. Well, that's a lot, but <laughs> you get the idea. They just it's gonna rub in, so it don't matter. Put some under there. Try to make sure I get it on those ends. I might have put too much in that one spot, but it's all good in the neighborhood. And go in with that. Make sure I get those sides. And I'm good to go, y'all one pass with my comb had to get it in there maybe two passes okay the less I comb the better I mean if I'm deep unless I'm detangling it so get that side get that in there like that y'all and then once I get through doing all of this I just sit under the, not sit under the, I just walk around the house with a towel on my head for a little while and just let it dry with the towel and then I will blow dry it. I will blow dry it. I got a comb on my blow dryer. Now I don't let y'all see my blow drying process because the blow dryer is in the other part of the house and I don't bring it in here because um, that's too much work. I got it already set up in my in my spot at my station. So uh I do that in the other room. And I don't feel like taking this big old camera in there, y'all. So I'm just gonna clip off these ends and I'm gonna let them hang, y'all. I'm gonna let them all hang. And then I'm gonna proceed to air dry for a little while. Walk around probably about an hour in the house. 
And then after this, I'm going to blow dry. I'm probably going to put a towel on for a little minute because it's still kind of wet, wet. And then I'm going to blow dry. And before I um, blow dry, right before I blow dry, I use this Silk Elements Mega Silk Olive Heat Protection Spray. That's what this is. I use this right before I blow dry. And then I blow dry each section at a time. Y'all can see I'm still working in sections. And when I rinse my hair, I rinse it in, in sections. One section at a time. That's exactly what I did. If I work in section, that just make it easier for me, honey. This process takes, I, I've been doing this for, for a minute. This process may take you in real time. I all got doggone day, but it's worth it in the end, honey. I am going to put my towel back on my head for a little while if I can find it. Where my towel at, y'all? And then I will be back once my hair is completely dry. I'm going to towel dry, let this towel sit on it for a little while. And then I will take it off and let it air dry for a little while. And then I will blow dry. Okay, y'all? So I will be back when I get done with that whole process. I need to take me a little break and go get me something to eat and, and hit myself in the eye and all that kind of good stuff. So uh, I'll be back when my hair is completely dry. Okay, y'all. So now it is time to show you guys. I blow dry my hair in sections, child. I was just going. I made sure this time I put my heat up a little bit on the blow dry because I'm going to get my hair braided, y'all. And I want to make sure she can part my hair and, and you know, I'm tender headed. So, you know, I'm trying to make it easy on myself and her at the same time. So, I put it on high heat so it's a little bit straighter than normal. My normal straight. My normal blowouts or whatever. So, anyway, this is what it looks like. Blue that. Blue that. Okay. That's that section. And then, oh, I ain't, did I even, I ain't even turn around. Yeah, I had, it looked like this, y'all. So, and then this, this section right here. Can I, so I need to scoop back. Do I need to scoop back for y'all? Okay, so, yeah, my hair is, um, <clears throat> I feel like my chill getting low up. What's going on every time? <laughs> I need some more cushion. But. This is my results of my deep condition, relax, not relax, not relax, y'all. Deep condition, uh, washed, color treated, and all of that color, not color treated, but dyed hair. And the last section. Okay, y'all, that is it. Woo! Praise the Lord. I'm so glad that's over with, y'all. That was a lot. A lot, I tell you, a lot. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Okay. So that is that is the end of my results, y'all. Turn around and show y'all what it looked like from behind. y'all that scalp in there show y'all that scalp ain't no more ball spots up in there praise the lord no more ball spots no more ball spots thank you jesus okay so that is it let's give y'all a quick comb through if y'all love this if y'all love y'all hair and y'all tend to hit it like me invest in this comb like for real <sighs> Shoot. I know I usually drop my hair for y'all, but that's about as good as I'm going to get today. <laughs> okay, y'all. So, that is it for my, my hair journey right here. My little hair. Dang, I hope y'all been keeping up, following along, and all of that other good stuff with me. So, I'm going to get my hair done soon. So, hopefully, she won't have no hard time with it, okay? Thank y'all so much for watching. Oh, look, I should have colored my hair all the way down because now I see that gold. See that gold, y'all? But I ain't worried about it because, um... 
It's only right there. It's just like right there. Dang, I should have like went down. But it's going to be braided up. So, I ain't going to, I ain't going to, look. Not going to let that bother me, y'all. <sighs> That's my reveal, y'all. My hair is still flourishing. Flourishing. Okay, y'all, let me stop playing. Because y'all, I will play in my hair till I can't play it. And no dog on more. Thank you guys so much for watching. And that's all I got to say in this video. And I will holler at y'all later. Bye.